Hey, what is up you guys? Welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Spacey and this is my little space. Today, a diaper review. I am so excited to talk about these. They are Halloween Haunt by Rears. Rears are one of my favorite diapers, diaper company, diaper brands. Um, I have a list and I will be talking about the list in full in another video, but today we are only talking about these awesome diapers. I love them. It is the spooky season and you know I'm on it with the spooky season gear. I am on the hunt for some Halloween diapers. I'm super disappointed because I missed my chance for the rears actually crossbone and skull, the skull and crossbone black and pink. I missed my chance to get them because they don't even make them anymore. I was absolutely devastated when I found out that was the case, but I was able to still get my hands on these. I have a pack of 13 here. It was actually sent to me by a lovely, wonderful diaper fairy that I recently met. So happy that I met them and so excited to continue our friendship further. Um, I am not really great at meeting people, but once I do, I really like to stick close and stay together forever. <laughs> and so I'm hoping that me and my diaper fairy could stay together forever because oh my gosh they blessed me with so many diapers i have so many reviews to get out to you guys i actually did make a baby usagi review but i have not yet posted it because i kind of hate it should i post it anyway anyway let's get into these diapers here they are a pack of 13 i don't know the price because they were sent to me as a gift but i will find out and i'll put the price up here somewhere i am currently wearing one and it is very very soggy so i'm trying not to show it too too much because i don't want the youtube police to get me and uh get me in that chokehold and beat me with their batons i don't want that so i um try not to show my diaper too too much but i will show you some pictures maybe over here and over here but this is how it looks as well it is a four tab diaper i love a four tab diaper because two tabs make me feel like a weird muffin top baby and it just doesn't fit me right but having a four tab i can at least like adjust it to my body and so it just doesn't give me that muffin top feel <laughs> that i hate so much this is perfect for halloween absolutely a thousand percent they definitely remind me of the um Seductive Violets by Rears. They're almost exactly like those except I think that the Seductive Violets were maybe slightly darker I will have to get them and compare them, but I wore them once before I loved them adored them The way that they swell up is so beautiful. I love it. It's perfect almost a lot like these um, but the Seductive Violets are like a plain, complete, smooth, royal purple, and there's like no print. This has a plastic landing strip, and I guess that has more, like, like you get more points with this one because of the landing strip. Not only is it because it's a print and I love print, I need like a cute little thing going on, um, and that gives, you know, it's giving Halloween, I love that. Uh, but the fact that it is a plastic landing strip actually helps out a lot because on the other ones that I was just talking about and I'm blanking right now brain fart um, they don't have a plastic landing strip and so like usually the tapes will rip right through that uh, I don't remember that happening with seductive violets but I do know that happens a lot with other diapers that I've worn and so I really do like having a plastic landing strip just to have a place to put the tapes because otherwise I can't I need some diapers I need a diaper that I can take off and put back on because I as you know probably if you've been here before you know I don't mess I have not messed so I need to take my diaper <coughs> <clears throat> so sometimes I need to take my diaper off and put it back on or like if it gets too hot and I have to put on a different diaper you know there are occasions where you have to take your diaper off and put it back on and so I for one uh, I for one need a diaper like this with a landing strip um, I have been able to put this on and take this back off, not needing extra tapes or anything like that. Um, and I definitely have been able to test that out of the pack. I've only worn three, but still, um, uh, by now I would be able to tell you some problems. Um, the diaper that I'm wearing right now is completely maxed out. It's way too full. The fact that I'm sitting on it right now is kind of making it spill a little bit up my leg, but not like to the point where it's getting on the floor or anything but it's no like by no means is it the diaper's fault i for sure maxed the diaper out and i kept pushing it and pushing it partly because i was making a video for patreon and partly because i wanted to see how far i could take it because <laughs> i do remember being able to pee quite a bit in the rears um seductive violets and so i just kind of wanted to see if i could push it the way that i pushed that one and it definitely holds 
about the same and so I'm really thinking that this is the same exact diaper but with the print on it uh, but you know don't quote me on that I don't know for sure but that's what it looks like and that's what it feels like so far very very similar to that that diaper I do love these and I recommend them a thousand percent especially for the spooky season like get these for the spooky season I am looking for more diapers that are on the spookier side because I die for cute spooky stuff or just straight up spooky stuff like i love scary things i need more scary things in baby form so if you know of any diaper prints or like a company that makes stickers specifically that are creepy or creepy cute for diapers please let me know about them in the comments wherever on instagram wherever just let me know because i need more spooky creepy diapers because that's just me that's my flavor that's my brand and i need it I need it. I crave it. I want it. Cassie is amazing. I don't know exactly what it is, so I will be putting it up there somewhere. I could possibly find out. Because, um, yeah, it says it's, uh, 5,100 milliliters. So yeah, it's 5,100 milliliters. And I think that's about the same as most rear diapers. I don't know. But I do know that it holds quite a bit. I do know that I have had this diaper on pretty much all day. And I had lots of juice and lots of water today. So I, I have been using it. <laughs> I have definitely been using it. Um, for sure, I would give it maybe like an 8 or a 9. The only reason I feel like there is room for improvement um, with the print. I feel like because it's a Halloween themed print, there could be more going on like if there was a wetness indicator on this bad boy sold like this is basically the best diaper in the world but it would be a 10 if there was a wetness indicator if there was more print or just like something more going on with this print it would be a 9 or even a 9.5 but right now without anything going on or a wetness indicator or anything extra like to give it that oomph I would give it a solid 8.5 I would definitely recommend these. I would definitely wear these again. I'm hoping that I can get my hands on more because I don't want another rear skull and crossbones incident where I miss my chance to ever even experience them ever add them to my collection. So don't want that to happen ever again. Definitely going to make sure to get my hands on another pack of these if I can. If you guys don't get them out first. <laughs> But that's really all I have to say about these diapers. Um, I will post some pictures and stuff of me wearing it. If you want to see like the full soggy experience and know about all of that wetness and whatnot, you gotta go over. I'm so sorry, Bradford. You have to go over to my Patreon because I'm really trying to keep over to my Patreon because I'm really trying to keep the soggy stuff like on the DL, <laughs> which is hilarious, diaper lover. <laughs> no I'm sorry but no really like I'm trying to keep it like a little bit out of public eye because I just I want to have a good time you know I love little space I want to be little um but I do have that part of that aspect of this the fact that it is a kink and everything and me being able to do patreon is helping me to be able to get things like this onesie that i have on today which is from onesies down under i adore this onesie i love onesies down under and i basically am trying to do whatever i can to get my hands on all of their halloween specialty onesies because they're like like i said there's not a whole lot of halloween type baby stuff and I, I love this like usually if you find a onesie that's Halloween style it's like super super scary or super adult looking rather than it being like baby but also spooky like I want all of it I want the full spectrum of scariness I want the cute scary I want the, the really scary I want the bloody scary I want the fluffy scary I want all of it you know what I mean and onesies down under delivered with this I had to get it it was flying off the shelves and I was gonna die if I didn't get it and so I got it, it was three day shipping Dora it has finger holes can't go wrong with that and so having patreon and you guys over there are oh my gosh it really helps me out i didn't really want to do like not safe for work because it's all not safe for work like none of this is safe for work i'm sorry if that hurts your feelings you shouldn't really talk about abdl stuff or little space while you're at work you just you just shouldn't but if you do and you get away with it you know that's that's cool i wish i could work where you were working if that's the case but it's all not safe for work pretty much but like when i say not when i say not safe for work i mean like sexual um i really didn't want to delve that deep into like the sexual side of abdl or whatever but i do like dibble dabble and experiment when i do um video requests and those video requests are what put the bacon on the table 
you hear me you hear me <laughs> and so I kind of don't mind it because like as long as I do that I can get my little space gear together I can make my nursery playroom and just be small and tiny whenever I'm doing all of that I'm not small and tiny you know I'm just entertaining um, but when I'm here with you guys I'm just being myself talking about some stuff and giving you the information on the things that I like which perfect segue to my second channel I do have a second channel where I'm basically only doing stuff that I like I'm going I'm opening up toys I'm doing crafts we're doing resin toy figures like the multiverse thingy at the end of the video I'm gonna like talk about a little I'm just talk more about that later but right if you guys have like some rears medium skull and crossbones left over and you wouldn't mind like a trade or um like just let me pay you and buy them off of you i have not been able to experience them and i just want to be able to wear them like once like the pink ones and the black ones so if you have skull and crossbone pink and black and they're either like a small medium please please consider trading with me i don't know which ones i'll show you like hit me up on instagram i'll show you the ones that i have and maybe we can work out a trade but I really need some more Halloween themed diapers and that's one of the main reasons I was so excited to receive these from my diapy fairy in the mail. So flipping excited. Do you not just love that? They're super silky smooth and extremely comfortable. They get more comfortable as you pee in them. Most diapers are like that, but like these are extra like that. Some diapers are really, really fluffy and dry and like they kind of give you like a weird rub and I don't like that. But these kind of had like a slight weird rub, like a, like a fluffy feel to them until I peed and then it like melded to my body a little. And yeah, definitely pee in these if you're trying. If you're feeling uncomfortable when you first put them on, just give it a little squirt <laughs> and you'll feel, you'll feel dandy. You'll be just fine. Um... This is kind of a short video, but uh, I just wanted to come and talk to you guys about these. It's been such a long time. Hopefully I can get out this other Baby Usagi um, diaper review as well for you, but it's so behind. This will be out at the start of October, so you should be seeing this video maybe October 1st, if not September 30th, super, super late at night. I don't know. We'll see. Um, Thank you so much for being here and watching my videos, supporting me. It helps me out so, so much. Even if you're not over on my Patreon, if you're on my Instagram, if you're watching my YouTube, all of this like sharing, the love and support that you send over my way, the happy, good vibes, all of it helps me so, so, so much. I started this channel because I was depressed and I just needed to focus on things that gave me joy. And I'm still doing that. I This gives me joy. I love doing this. I love talking to you guys. I love having little space. I love being a little... I even love my regression now, which I didn't previously like doing. I, I hated it. I thought it was weird and stupid and gross. And I hated myself. But now I love it. I love parts of me that I didn't think I would love before. And it's all because of you. So thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I really hope to see you super soon. Bye. By the way, you guys, I did want to talk a little bit more about, uh, so the video's over now. The video's over, does that mean I can show you just a little bit more of my diaper? <laughs> really quick, I gotta tell you, the second channel that I have, I recently was supposed to be uploading a brand new video of me opening up some of these guys, which are the Miniverse Diner series the new ones that just came out. I also have a couple of the older series as well. I opened some of the older series and I put some together in a video, but I was not able to post that video. I lost the footage. It was already being uploaded to YouTube, but I don't know what happened. It just was like error this, error that, and it just did not post. So I'm gonna actually go ahead and film a brand new one today, and I'll be posting that over on the second channel, which is called Planet Spacey. I'll leave it in the description. I hope that you guys love me over there i hope that you freaking subscribe and you enjoy all of that content because even though i won't really be showing my face or showing my diapers so much on that channel i still will be talking a lot about and exploring a bunch of different things that expand and deepen my regression in my little space and the head space itself so i really hope that you'll enjoy it over there as well as much as you enjoy me over here and support me the same way that you do over here i appreciate you so much and now the video is done. See you over at Planet Spacey. Bye.